Hello everyone, welcome to the Flashforge official channel. We've been with you for three episodes in a row now, and we sincerely appreciate your support and companionship. Without further ado, let's start by revealing the answer to last episode's question. How many square meters does the Flashforge filament factory cover? The correct answer is 9,000 square meters. Many of you got it right, and we've randomly selected a lucky winner. It's you. Please send an email to this address with your username, a screenshot of your comment, and your shipping information. If you didn't win, don't worry. There's another chance this episode to win a roll of filament. The new question will be at the end of this video, so stay tuned. Today we're going to talk about one of our most popular filaments, PLASE. PLASE is a cost-effective PLA filament that retains most of the benefits of traditional PLA. With its adjusted formula, it ensures excellent print quality while also offering a price advantage. This filament is incredibly user-friendly, with great flow and stability, making it less prone to clogging and suitable for all mainstream 3D printers. It's biodegradable, environmentally friendly, non-toxic, and safe, making it perfect for home and educational settings. Prints made with PLASE have smooth surfaces and clear details, making it an excellent choice for projects that require high precision and detail. It has low shrinkage, providing stable dimensions throughout the printing process, and maintains consistent performance even after repeated heating and cooling, making it ideal for long prints. Currently, Flashforge's PLA SE filament is available in 20 carefully curated colors, designed to meet all your creative needs. PLA SE is highly versatile, suitable for educational models, DIY projects in maker spaces, creative works by artists, and more. It's perfect not just for imaginative creations, but also for home decor, toys, and rapid prototyping. When using PLA-SC, we recommend setting the nozzle temperature between 190 degrees C and 240 degrees C, the heated bed temperature between 25 degrees C and 60 degrees C, and keeping the print speed between 4300 mm2s. For higher speed printing, be sure to use higher temperatures and don't forget to turn on the cooling fan. A quick reminder, PLA-SE is sensitive to moisture, so please seal and store it in a dry place after use. That's all for today's video. This episode's question is, how many colors are available for Flashforge's PLA Pro? If you know the answer, drop it in the comments. If you're not sure, go check out the previous video. As always, we'll pick one lucky winner from the comments to receive a roll of filament. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll announce the correct answer and the winner in the next video. If you have any questions or suggestions, feel free to leave a comment below. Thank you for watching and see you next time.